Barack Obama has finally officially named Hillary Clinton as Secretary of State. Yeah. Yeah. Now, things got pretty intense on the campaign trail. Now, here's the question. Can they really put the past aside? I mean, the, can, they, can they really Look at work that, what together? What a cute Look. couple. <laughs> <laughs> it's called politics. Oh, it okay. is. When they asked him in his press conference, uh, you know, you're, you're all so cozy. What about the terrible things you said about right, each right. other? <laughs> and he sort of dodged it and said, well, you know, essentially we have the same views. But... Um, you know, I guess that is politics. I don't know. I, think, I, I feel like it's, you know, to say that things that are said in the campaign are exaggerated. It's like, well, which things? Is it your promises or is it your slams on your opponent? You know, Barack Obama at one point, they both exchanged things when she said, you know, I will put forward my experience. And he said, and Barack Obama will put forth the speech he gave in 2002. He yeah. said periodically when Senator Clinton gets upset, she kind of throws a point? knock at somebody. Well, to well, yeah, but, 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 but the truth is, that that he, she, she took the job that he offered, yeah, so they've made is, a piece. And also, the, 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 the uh, accusation that he wasn't experienced enough, he certainly has overcome that by by appointing every experienced well, person. That he kept dates. I, mean, I yeah. think that sends a message and in terms of our national security. The right wing security. loves these choices. Even Rush Limbaugh was these saying actually, he liked Hillary yeah. Clinton. Yeah. Once briefed yeah. about the terrorism and especially upon what just happened in Mumbai, I think he actually did make good decisions. Yeah. I think keeping yeah. Gates in there, mm -hmm. um, keeping was a Jim Jones. Aren't you glad Elizabeth? Tell the truth. Aren't you glad? What do you think? I'm, I'm waiting. I told you I, I had a very excited moment. I feel like I'm, I'm excited to see what happens. I think given the choices he's made, I feel as though they're sensible. It's a win-win win for picture. everybody. But if you listen to what he's saying, he actually sounds a lot more like George Bush than he did during his... Listen to what he said. George Bush these days is sounding... George so Bush, excuse me. George Bush is sounding a little more me. like Barack Obama where he just did an interview and said... He's not sure his biggest regret, if he, if he had known that there were not weapons of mass destruction, I don't want to quote, because I never can quote exactly, but the gist of it was he was, he, he was still not sure whether or not he would have invaded. I mean, yeah. that, that, was a, that, was a, uh, that was a big decision. George Bush, right. yeah. George Bush just said this. In your uh, interview yesterday. with Barack Obama, it was interesting, because he, I thought it was an incredible sit-down, but he still, the one thing that bothered me, despite his great choices, I think, for cabinet members, it bothered me that he still couldn't. This is a man with great words. He couldn't find the word victory to define what's been happening in Iraq. people don't bothered. think it's a victory. Yeah, he is. said, you talk to said, the troops there. You want to talk about removing a regime that just murdered to the people? Because we all, we all care about that. About just, one segment of time, and it's not a victory. It's just mm. one. And also, I don't think you can actually in. declare a victory because this is not World War II. You, you cannot define these things by victory or not victory. Are we going to change Iraq over to being uh, an American democratic society? No, we're not. So I don't think we can define it the same way we used to define it. Victorious no, in it, many ways, and that women are voting, children can go to school, people are being tortured. But that doesn't mean, vi but it does not mean victory the way they're saying, we're going to come out of there victorious. I think what we have gone over to do, and what we need to clean up, are the things that we have caused, the problems that we have pre created. That, I think, keeping a relationship with Iraq will be a victory. Making sure that they are... I'm them. not sure that we have, you know, Elizabeth. About the fact that I, some people you, say it was a distraction to go to Iraq and that we're having trouble in Pakistan and Pakistan and, and, and Afghanistan, Afghanistan because of Iraq. Let me just so tell you I'm what, not sure that there was a, there's a victory, a victory sure. to be had. Can I, I think it's the word. People who have served there I'm what beginning they're to sound like what Tina Fey was talking about. But can I just tell you what Barack Obama said? He said it's an improvement. I mean, he did, yeah. and, he paused and it a is. long time before even giving that sort of well, compliment. But he said it. He said it. Elizabeth, you know. And he said it. Don't you know. think maybe maybe we, people maybe we, should maybe be pausing should before, pause they before they speak? Sure. Before we speak. I just yeah. said, I don't think it's a bad thing to say, you know what? I don't know if we can declare victory. It no, does, it's other, nothing against, I'm sorry, I just yeah. want to finish saying this. It's nothing against our soldiers and the folks who are fighting over yeah, there that he's all. not able to see. And we're going to come out because remember the last time that happened, there was a big banner on a ship. So we really want to we say, you know what? We've, work, we've been look, able to do yeah, but, what we Elizabeth, needed to can do. Can you really That's truthfully not say that you're a perfect mother? That's like saying I'm a perfect I've mother. I've never said that. Why no, would you even try to Because a country is not perfect either. A country is not perfect. I didn't say we were perfect. Stop putting words in my mouth. I did not the say we were perfect. Of what I said, you we, said when things go wrong in the world. Who do people turn to? They turn to the United States because we A lot of help. times, yes. We yes. aid. Yes. We do this. But so not always. Think that